Google Drive is not just for Google Docs and Sheets and those sorts of things. You are also able to store Microsoft Word documents, PDFs, JPEGs, um, videos, other kinds of documents. It doesn't just have to be a place that you're using to store or to create Google products. In this folder, you can see that I have a Google Doc, and I can tell that by this icon. I also have a Word document, and I also have a PDF. There are several things you can do with these. I can store my Word documents here by just going to New, File Upload, and I can upload my Word document into this folder. When I'm opening this Word doc, I want you to notice what happens. When I click on it, it's not going to open it because it's not a Google doc. But there are several things that I can do with this. Right now, I am just in what's called a preview. I am seeing a preview of that Word document. Up here at the top, you're going to notice I have several choices. I can open it with Word. That's going to download it down to my computer and open up Microsoft Word. But I also notice that I have a little drop down delta here with open with. When I click on that, you'll notice that I have several choices. One that I want to use is the one called Google Docs. I can convert any Microsoft Word document into a Google Doc. Now, why would I want to to convert a Google, or excuse me, to convert a Word document? Well, if I keep it in Microsoft Word, I could share it with them, but we would not be able to collaborate on this document. If this is something that I want people to be able to work together to collaborate on, then I need it in a Google Doc. So I'm going to go back to that. And I'm going to come down here and I'm going to click on Google Docs. And you're going to notice that it's converting it into a Google Doc. Now, one thing I need to tell you is that sometimes when it converts, you'll notice that it kind of moved some of my images around. But I can just click on that and move it back over. <clears throat> All right. So here I see my Google document. Let me go back to my folder. You see it opened in a new tab. I'm going to go back to that folder. There is still my preview. It did not get rid of my Word document. Do you notice when I get out of there that I still have the Word document? I'm going to refresh my screen because sometimes it takes a minute to show. But I want you to notice what happens. Here is my Word document, and now you notice that I have one that says Google Drive, but it's a Google Doc. Don't worry about that picture there. It just hasn't caught up that I already moved it. Okay, so I can store Microsoft Word, PowerPoint, Excel, those sorts of things, and I can always convert them over into the Google product. Another thing I can store in here is PDFs. I'm going to open this one up. But when I open this up, I do want you to notice that it is in a preview. I can open it with Adobe Acrobat, but that's going to download it down onto my computer. See how it's going to use those apps that are on my computer. I can always click on one, I'm going to right click on this, and you notice that I have a choice to download it down to my computer out of Google Drive. 